all right hi everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is timmy banjo if it's your first time here and you haven't seen this face before i am timmy banjo and that means you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel so kindly hit the subscribe button below and hit the notification bell and also like this video because so everything in order subscribe hit the notification bell and like this video and if you aren't new here just like this video so if you want to know how to use the um apple cider vinegar effectively for effective weight loss i think you should keep watching this video <laughs> Alright, so this is the apple cider vinegar I always use for my um, drinks, for my tea and for my weight loss, for everything weight loss and so on and so forth. And I, a lot of people have been asking which one should they use, which one should they buy, should it be any apple cider vinegar or just um, any vinegar or must it be this one. I'm sure it must be this one because of how it is made you have to look for what you have to look for this particular this particular one that they wrote with the mother so right here they wrote with the mother and it's undiluted it's undiluted apple cider vinegar if you turn the bottom you see particles underneath so all this is what you should get when you are buying your apple cider vinegar so this must be the one you should use if you want to see difference in your in your in your weight if you want to see changes in your gut area in your tummy and so on and so forth if you haven't seen the video where i lost all my fats or where i lost all the weight in my tummy area i'm going to leave that link here so make sure you click on that link and watch the video all right moving on so um most people don't know how to use this um, apple cider vinegar many people think it's the more you put in your drink the more effectiveness you see or the more um the effect is when you want to lose weight or when it comes to weight loss no if you do that you might be hurting yourself it's going to make you bloated and it, it will affect your teeth if you use it long term in that quantity so i'm going to be showing you guys the quantity you should use for your tea and the measurements and so on and so forth so make sure you do not use a lot also you for you to see for you to see differences or you, for you to see changes in your body you have to be consistent you have to be consistent with the apple cider vinegar you can't just use it for one day or two days and say oh i've not seen any difference you can't use it for one week you have to use it for at least a month before you can conclude that oh is it's working for me and i want to emphasize on the fact that you should use it for at least a month or six weeks before you can conclude if it works for you or not and i hardly hear about people apple cider doesn't work for so if you use this for at least six months i'm sure you're going to see a difference in your body and how your body reacts and your your metabolism your digestion and all that so make sure you are consistent consistent with the use of apple cider vinegar for the measurement of apple cider vinegar i'm still going to show you guys practically how you measure that so but for now this is what i do i use this cover for measurement if you're using the whole cover if the quantity of the apple cider vinegar you're putting is going to fill the cover make sure it goes into one liter of water one liter of tea or one liter of anything you're drinking for 500 ml half is enough 500 ml half of this cover is enough and for one liter one cover is enough i hope i am being explanatory as possible so let me just show you guys how you should go about the measurements in a very practical way and how i make my tea how i make my water and just soak it and leave it there all right so this is my cup and this is about 250 to 300 ml i'm going to go in with um lemon slices two of my lemon slices and cucumber slices this is three slices and also ginger slices i'm going to add one bag of quality in the cup and some hot water So the perfect measurement for apple cider vinegar will be about half to quarter of the cover of this um this bottle this cover here so this isn't full 
this is about half of the um, cover and I'm just going to add everything here so that's all you need in your cup of about 300 ml so if you have 500 ml you can go in with, with half of this cover in your tea or in your water this is a perfect recipe for weight loss this is a perfect recipe for digestion this is a perfect recipe for metabolism i mean quick and good metabolism this is a perfect recipe for um, clearing your gut and losing your tummy fat and all that so if you have this cup at least two of this cup in a day be sure to see results in about four to six weeks please do not boil just leave it soaked like this for about five to ten minutes before you drink so you can also um, soak this in your flask or water bottle this is a flask here you can soak this in the flask and just have this throughout the day so this will just keep cleansing your bowel area and your gut area will be looking slimmer and slimmer so once you finish your food you drink your water and you need something to just drink you can just keep drinking this throughout the day or throughout the night till you fall asleep and the next morning be sure to have a very very fine gut area and you know your bowel will be clean and also your skin and also have your skin looking really really good because apple cider vinegar also helps with your skin and your and your hair texture so ahead so next i'm going to show you guys how i put apple cider vinegar in water i'll show you guys how to put it in your tea i'm going to show you guys how to put it in your water all right so this is um water and lemon i have soaked for about good four to five hours and this is a good detoxification um, combination I'm just going to pour the water into the cup now I'm going to put a slice of cucumber in water slice of lemon in my water also For my apple cider vinegar I'm going to be using less than a cover of this in my water So this is less than a cover or this is less than half of a cover that's all you need in your water that quantity is enough for you inside this measurement of water so like i said earlier you don't need to pour the whole container inside your drink or inside your water before you start to see changes you just need a very little amount of the apple cider vinegar in your drink for you to see changes it's more of the consistency that makes you see that change it's more of the dedication that makes you see that change and also your diet so yeah allow me drink my water so with these few tips i hope you're able to make good recipes awesome recipes and if you form any other recipes that i haven't mentioned here with the apple cider vinegar please let me know send me photos send me pictures you know send them to my socials i'm going to leave my socials in the description box below so please make sure you send them to me let's be friends all right let's connect all right i hope that was quite explanatory and i hope i was able to show you guys everything that constituted of the tea so other other ways you can have your apple cider vinegar you can use your tea this is quality and sometimes i use this one i just drink this one it's green tea i just drink this one put half a cover inside my cup and cut my lime lemon like i showed previously cut my lemon cucumber and so on and so forth and i just leave it soaked Remember not to boil, please do not boil your um, lemon, do not boil your ginger, do not boil your cucumber, your cucumber. Oh. Do not boil them because you'll only be killing the nutrients and the, I don't know, the, everything inside the um, cucumber and lemon. It's cucumber. Cucumber. <laughs> don't don't boil it just leave it soaked in your tea in your hot water whatever it is or in your drinking water please do not boil because you end up killing the nutrients in it also this is twinning tea this is twinning tea this is also a green tea lemon flavored green tea you can also use this in your with your apple cider vinegar it's very good and it also helps with detoxification english is add 
it helps with detox it helps with detox and it helps to clear your gut area your bowel everything makes you less bloated or not to bloat at all so this tea twinning tea lip tea any tea top tea green tea herbal tea make sure you um make sure the tea doesn't have sugar make sure it doesn't have milk because you're just going to be undoing yourself if you end up putting apple cider vinegar inside that so any tea of your choice that you choose to make you put that measurements that i i highlighted as it should be and hopefully in a matter of six weeks you'll be seeing differences all right so i believe i have mentioned everything here comments are welcome in the comment section down below and if you haven't subscribed to till now please make sure you hit that subscribe button and also hit the notification bell please give this video a thumbs up a huge thumbs up i remember to put your thumb where your mouth is okay don't just like this video inside your mind you need to put your thumb there mm so please like this video give this video a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching i hope to see you in my next video please stay blessed and stay safe all right please guys stay safe try as much as possible to stay safe thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you guys in my next video bye